Hey guys, in this video we will be crocheting size 0 to 3 month baby booties. For this pattern, you are going to need a size F crochet hook, worsted yarn in the color of your choice, scissors, and a yarn needle. At any point in the video, if I am going too fast for you, just hit that pause button until you catch up. Let's get started. Alright, for round one, we are going to make your slip knot and then you are going to chain 12. Okay, after you have your chain 12, in the second chain from your hook, one, two, you are going to half double crochet in the next 10. Okay, in that very last chain, you are going to make three half double crochet, all in that very last chain. At this point, we are going to be working on the opposite side of the chain. So you are going to make another 10 half double crochet in the next 10 stitches. And after that last stitch, you are then going to slip stitch in the very first stitch that you made in this round. And then you will chain one. Okay, to start round two, you're going to half double crochet in the same stitch as your chain. Just one half double crochet in that stitch. And then you're going to half double crochet in the next nine stitches.
All right, for the next part, you are going to half double crochet increase in the next three stitches. So you're gonna put two half double crochets in each of the next three stitches. You are now going to half double crochet in the next nine stitches across. In this last stitch, you are going to add an, a half double crochet increase. So add two half double crochets in that very last stitch. You are then going to slip stitch to the first stitch you made in that round. Once that's complete, chain one and you have completed round two. To start round three, you are going to put a half double crochet increase in the same stitch that you're starting in. So you'll add two this time to that first stitch. And then you are going to increase as well in the next stitch. So add two half double crochets to the second stitch as well. You will then continue on making nine half double crochets across, one in each stitch. Next, you will be half double crochet increasing in the next six stitches. Continue along the opposite side making nine half double crochet across.
In the last two stitches, you are going to half double crochet increase in both stitches. Go ahead and make your slip stitch. And then your chain one. And you have finished the sole of the shoe. Let's go ahead and cut off that tail that you've got there. And we'll move on to round four. In round four, we will be working in the back loop only of each stitch. You're going to start in the stitch where your, where your chain is made. And you're going to half double crochet in each stitch around. Remember to work these half double crochets in the back loop only of round three. All right, now you're going to slip stitch in that first stitch you made, and that completes round four. And then chain one. This is what round four will look like when it's finished. Now we're going to half double crochet in that first stitch where your chain is at, and then half double crochet in the next 12 stitches.
All right, next we are going to half double crochet decrease seven times. So you're going to yarn over and then you're gonna pull your yarn through two loops and then yarn over again, pull through two loops and then pull through all three. And you're gonna make seven decreases in a row. To finish off round five, you are going to half double crochet in the next 11. and then slip stitch to that first stitch and chain one. And that is the end of round five. To start round six, you're going to half double crochet in that same stitch as your chain and then half double crochet in the next 11 stitches. You are now going to half double crochet decrease five times. And then you will half double crochet over the next nine stitches. All right, add that slip stitch and then your chain one and that finishes round six. And this is what it looks like so far. All right, for round seven, you're going to half double crochet in that same stitch as your chain. And then you will half double crochet in the next 12 stitches.
Okay, we are going to half double crochet decrease two times. And now you will half double crochet in the next nine stitches. And make that last slip stitch there and chain one and that finishes round seven we have one round left to go so for round eight we are going to be single crocheting one in each stitch around so just single crochet all the way around until you get back to the beginning All right, and make that very last slip stitch. And at this point, we will cut our yarn. And pull it through your loop. And then take your yarn needle and you're going to weave it through the booty so that it does not come apart. Alright, now you just go ahead and snip that off with your scissors. Now that we had made the first baby booty, you can go back to the beginning and make the second one. And this is what it'll look like at the end. I hope you enjoyed this pattern and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe buttons for more videos. Thanks for watching!